Jim Bowen. I live at Climview Farm. My family have been farming here since 1750 um, and we've been running a care farm here since 2011. We support different vulnerable people using different projects with meaningful outcomes. Today we're working with a big refugee um, support of community groups and, and individuals throughout the whole of South Wales. We've got shipping containers here, people are volunteering to um, sort of sort out the donated stuff, make sure everything's labelled and is on the list of what we've been asked for by Cos Kindness. And we're packing it in as tightly as we can into the containers. DHL have done us a fantastic deal on getting the containers here, and they've done us a fantastic deal again on getting the containers from here shipped down to, to Cos for it, you know, as cheap as they possibly can. And so all this equipment here has been processed to be as, you know, make sure we're not sending anything down that's going to be wasted. It's all stuff that's been donated by members of the community. Um, it's fantastic generosity, it's fantastic kindness from all over the place. Hello, I'm Jane from Clinview and um, we've been collecting for probably about two weeks now and everyone's been really generous. So we have got we've nearly filled one container. And today we've been sending tents, sleeping bags, toiletries, clothing, babies, nappies, all sorts of things. My name's Robert, uh, I'm from Carmarthen. I came up today with a load of stuff from Carmarthen because people need it, you know. These, these people are human beings and they're suffering and just uh, seeing the Welsh people responding is amazing. It's, uh, it's been absolutely incredible. Hi, my name is Peter Natta. We've been collecting these goods to slip off to, uh, to developing countries for them to have the, the, them, their families, the opportunity to grow and adapt to the environment around them. This project here is part of our really good idea project where we get old wheelchairs and things that people don't want anymore and we fix them up and we ship them down to South Africa where our partners distribute them to 150 community groups over there. Yeah, yeah.